Crafters, it's Louise with you today and I am sharing a new scrapbook layout process video for Kidaholic kits and this page is something probably that I didn't actually plan. What you'll see is that while I was creating another layout for my DT work, I actually um, had uh, some extra ink, um, so Distress Oxide spray ink left over and I kind of thought, okay, I really need to use this so let's pop something on a page and see what happens. So I've made this sort of circle and added some splatters and I'm going to let that dry and then come back in for a second layer and just tidy up that circle a little bit. Um, now I did also sort of think about these um, washi tape X's in the background um, but later on you'll see I do actually peel them off the page because they just weren't working for me. So I picked a photo from my stash and it's a really cute one um, from Mother's Day this year. I realized um, in all my scrapping that I hadn't actually had a family Family photo in quite a while so I decided that it was time to get organized and get that family photo happening. Now that I've mounted that um, I'm going to pick through some of the embellishments and one of the things I love about the Kitaholic kits is that there are so many embellishments. You really get so much bang for your buck and in terms of um, what you can do with a layout there there's endless options so so much available to you and such good value but the the ability to create pages is really um, something that's so easy and in this case you know you can see um, by pulling out a few elements that I really like, um, a couple of the stickers, we've got some leaves there as well. You can make your layouts as minimalist or you know as busy as you so desire. So in this stage of the layout um, I'm quite happy with the background, I want to leave some white space and um, I'm just going to adhere everything down, add a couple of little words and uh, I'm actually going to do my journaling on the computer and print this out afterwards and then this layout will be complete. So um, nice and simple, easy ways to create. I know you guys like to watch videos that um, aren't too technical and this is one of those videos. So I really hope you enjoyed. Please of course leave some comments or some feedback. Make sure you've hit the subscribe button and if you aren't already a subscriber to Kitaholic Kits, pop on over and check them out. Such good value, well worth your while. Thanks for watching and have a great day.